Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Ikatokezea. It came to happen. Hiyo siku ya pili hiyo. The following day. Kambi the camp imekuwa tup was bare. Kwaenda kupambazuka coming to dawn. Mfalme wa wa, 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 wa Samaria. The king of Samaria. Akapata habari kambi ya washami haina mtu hata mmoja. report there's no one in the camp of the Syrians. Akachukua magari na matela na nini kwenda kusomba vyakula kwa sababu. To go and carry the food in the stores. Mana wao walikuwa na uhuru wa kutembea huko nje. They were free to move. They Samaria walikuwa wamejifungia huko. Samaria had locked themselves in a wall. Hawawezi toka. They could not get out. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Wacha wa Samaria, the Samaritans wasome vyakula kwa gala za washami. Took all the food in the stores of the cities, all the barley, Kishori, all the kind marage, of rice, rice beans, mafuta ya kukaranga, all the cooking oil. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Ikatokezea hiyo jioni. It came to happen that evening. Vyakula tele Samaria, tele, 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 tele. There's no longer hunger again. Njaa iliyofanana ili iondoke. The hunger that sounded for baada ya miaka kadha wa kadha. It's after number of years. Paka nchi hiyo mfalume atavute misaada huku na huku huku na huku huku na huku. Lakini Mungu mwenye uwezo. But God with the power. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Siku hiyo ya pili kukaja chakula. The following day food was full. What? Okay. Wacha yule akida yule. That commander that the one keeping the keeping the and kupima and measuring and sharing the food. Hakula ukisoma tusomee. Never ate when you read the Bible. Tusomee alafu tumalize na Luka. Well for then we finish. Wana wewe ukae na dhiki. Why should you stay with problems? Unaaminishwa dhiki usiogope. You are meant to believe God fear. Itakuondokea. It will go. Maana Bwana ni Bwana wa wote wenye mwili. The Lord is not Hakuna gumu lisilowezekana. There's nothing impossible unto him. Ujaliwe kuamini. They never to believe. Maana Yesu alifuta hati hati ya dhambi. Na kuigogomea msalabani. Na akasema yamekwisha. And he said it's finished. Hata sijapokunya kwanye kuna namna gani. Itakuwa nyeupe kama theluji. Kwa wao wanaokubali na kuamini. Ujaliwe kuamini maana They never to believe in the prophecy. Wacha akili zako. You do away with your understanding. Kwa yangu hii ni kubwa. Sing my problem is mighty. Imekalia muno miaka mingi. It has stayed for long. Itaondoka kwa jioni moja. It will go away one evening. Na Mungu uwezo wake ni mkubwa. Because God is great. Read for us. Elisha akasema, lisikieni neno la Bwana. Bwana asema hivi, kesho panapo saa hii kipimo cha unga mzuri kitauzwa kwa shekeli na vipimo viwili vya shairi kwa shekeli langoni pa Samaria. Basi yule akida ambaye mfalme alikuwa akitegemea mkono wake, akamjibu ile mtu wa Mungu akasema, "Tazama, kama Bwana angefanya madirisha mbinguni, Je, jambo hili lingewezekana? Akamwambia, angalia, wewe utaliona kwa macho yako, lakini hutakula. Then Elisha said, "Hear ye the word of the Lord, thus saith the Lord, tomorrow about this time shall a measure of fine flour be sold for a shekel and two measures of barley for a shekel in the gate of Samaria." Then a lord on whose hand the king leaned answered the man of God and said, Behold, if the Lord will make windows in heaven, might this thing be? And he said, Behold, thou shalt see it with thine eyes, but shalt not eat thereof. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The prophet says to you, you are looking at your problems. You look at the way you are led to goodness. You look at the destruction in your life. The way you've stayed for long. That's nothing. That's nothing. That's nothing. We are never to believe. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The prophecy. This is the word of God. Whenever I spoken as you, don't look at your problem. Don't look at the way you are led to go through. Don't look at the lack of peace you have for you. Be able to believe in the prophecy. The Lord says, He shall save one with the house. Then you are testified to, He saved this person. This is the prophecy. Never to believe. Now, Kiona, and when you see, you don't attend good things. Look very well. Is in there any prophecy at all? And your heart, you question this preacher here. He doesn't know the condition as it is. My problem here, I defeated all the experts and the physicians. 
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Shida yako si kitu. Your problem is nothing. Mungu ni mkuu. God is greater. Anasema yeye ni bwana wa wote wenye mwili. Hakuna guma. Lord unto all in flesh. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Ujaliwe kuamini. We are never to believe that way. Yesu alipigwa. Jesus was whipped. Kwa kwake ni pone. Maybe he. Alimwaga damu kwa ajili ya msamaha wa dhambi zangu. For the sake of the forgiveness of my sins. Uamini hilo. You believe that way. Lakini wewe unasema but you say now. Hapana. Nothing. Ndipo angalia sana. Look very well. Kuingia katika mema leo you je uliamini jana? You don't get to do things. Do you believe? From the time you are saying. Hakuna neno la unabii ulifundishwa. Is there any prophecy you are taught? Kuhusu shida hii ambayo imesimama pale. The problem stuck in you. Je uliamini? Did you believe? Ulipokea? Did you receive? Ulifurahia nitapata? Were you happy at this? Au ulisema ai? Or maybe you question. Mbili aombe lakini nangoja pale. The preacher to spray but I'm waiting. Hata mimi nije nipate mimi. I to obey. Je nime na amani mimi? Happy. Hata mwana huyu aokoke. My child to be saved. Hata mke huyu abadilike. I wife to change. Ah, I'll be happy that day. Sikio nitachinja mbusu That day I'll slaughter goat and eat. Chinja tayari ule maana zimesha. Slaughter right now because it's done. Mtolee tayari Mungu shukurani maana umeshapa. You offer to God thanks because it's done. Maana imani ni kuwa anaweka na mambo hayako. Because faith is an evidence of things not seen. Ishara the signs zinafuatana follow na walio ame. Those who believe huyu hakufikia ishara kuliona This one didn't reach the sign why Maana alisema ah because he said now madirisha yangefunguliwa the windows open up ndio tungejua ni kweli na yesu we don't know whatever you're saying is the truth Akaambiwa utaviona utakuwa He was told you shall see but you won't eat the Endo kasume mwenyewe hiyo historia hapo Go hakuna. and read the, the narrative downwards Kweli hakula Tuli never ate Na kweli kufikia jioni hiyo siku nyingine ya pili And tuli the second day evening Samaria ilikuwa imejaa chakula tena Samaria was full na of hazina na madola yote of food and all the treasures of dollars ilikuwa sherehe it was party and functions watoto walimeshiba the children are failed walikuwa hawaonekani mtaani wale they were not seen in the village now they are playing the jioni hiyo ya siku ya pili that even second day walienda mpirano wanapiga bodi they go to the game maana tumbo wameshiba unga wa stomachs are full the bali na vya poo and all kind of chapatis and donuts zilikarangwa the nuts hata wewe ile tabu itakuondokea you to the problem will go away kutakuja kuwa na harufu nyumbani mwako ya vitunguu you'll have a savor of hata na wewe nawe utoke na bakuli mwambie jirani shika dona ndizo hizi you to, to give something to your neighbor na karimati ndio si wewe uh, leo ndio unapewa tu kila siku some nuts you give wewe to your neighbor na bakuli lako you to go with your bowl to okay, amini ha aliwapa hawa na living he will give them he'll also give me maana mungu hana upendeleo because god is not respect of persons hallelujah hallelujah